What's going on, guys? It's Sub Zero Genesis. Uh, wishing you guys a happy Halloween. And I'm laughing because <laughs> this is not my plus size costume. Yes, there is a plus size Sub Zero costume you could buy. Uh, this is the normal one, and that is why <laughs> I am nipping right out of this thing, bro. My nips are like making a run for it, homie. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> Anyways, guys, my internet's been out for like a day and a half, so I apologize for no videos, but, um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's fucking Halloween time, bitch, and we celebrating early because I'll tell you something, bro, shit, it's just, you know, life moves so fast, and before you know it, we're back in January, and all the fucking holidays are gone, and that fucking blows, um, <clears throat> Also, there was something on my mind that I wanted to talk about briefly. I have to be careful not to rant when it comes to this matter, but let me take a little swig here. <clears throat> Alright, so let me just get this out of the way. Listen, to my trolls, I want you to know I genuinely love you. And I'm so flattered that you're still making videos about me in 2024. But I will not be watching or responding to any of them. So guys, stop telling me who's making vids. I don't care. I'm not giving these NPC clowns attention. Okay, These are people who are just very desperate and don't know how to get con you know, don't know how to get numbers on their own. If I were to feed them, I would only be hurting them by doing that because, Clout is a very dangerous thing. It's an addiction and it can drive you crazy. I have trolls who are literally nuts now because they were addicted to the clout that they got from me in 2019 and they know they're not getting it anymore. And it's literally made them nuts. <laughs> so I don't want to do that to anybody else. And aside from that too, um, guys listen, there's nothing I can say to those of you who hate me or think that I'm some kind of weirdo. There's genuinely nothing I can say to change your mind, okay? Uh, there's nothing I can do to please you. There's there's nothing I can, you know... I mean, that that's pretty much all there is to say. Like, you're always going to hate me no matter what. Because the only way you would ever like me is if I became like you. And I choose not to be a simp. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that's just how it is, homie. I walk to the beat of my own drum. I choose to be weird and different because I embrace being unique. If you don't like that, you can go watch a boring YouTuber like PewDiePie. Okay? <laughs> yes, I'm a bit of a shitlord. But for those of you who take me literal in that regard... Frankly, you're just stupid, and there's no reasoning with someone stupid like you. You just have a very low IQ. I would suggest reading a book. <laughs> so anyways, guys, that's really all I have to say on that matter. I'm, I'm not going to go into it, you know, uh, any further than I need to. But I will say this, too. Like, bro, I'm like 40 now, okay? I will literally be 40 years old in like a year and a half. Some of you guys who hate on me, you're you're literally young enough to be my son. Do you not find that the least bit strange having a flame war <laughs> with someone who's that much older than you? You know, I guess these Zoomers, uh, they're just kind of fucked up in the head. You know, a lot of them unfortunately are narcissists because of social media, and so they don't they don't care about the respect of elders. Even though I'm making myself sound super old saying that. Um, the respect of people much older than them. They don't care because they think they know everything, which in return, I guess, makes them feel like they can debate and uh, be mean to people, you know, who are like their dad, who are almost as old as their dad or older. Um, <clears throat> I wish you guys well, but yeah, that's all I have to say about that. Uh, please, guys, stop telling me who's making videos. I do not care. Okay, I, I'm just going to block you from my channel if you tell me. And I don't like blocking people, but, you know, I know most of you just want me to get mad. You want me to get angry and be Jared Lolcow. Well, guys, that's the thing, too. It's like, listen, dude, okay, <laughs> I'm really good at trolling, and I don't like to toot my own horn, but I am. 
And the reason why I know this is because I've actually triggered people enough to where they've done really stupid shit to me. Like swat my house and, you know, et cetera, et cetera. Stuff I'm not even going to go into. <laughs> because that's how good I am at pissing people off. And, uh... I guess I'm just kind of past that point in my life. Plus, I don't want to do that to my parents. I'm with my parents now, and that's the reason why I don't live stream too. It's because, well, number one, they don't want me to, which I don't blame them for. I've been swatted over 10 times now. But aside from that, I just, you know, they're old, okay? They shouldn't have to put up with that crap. And to those of you who think I'm abusing my parents, you can genuinely go fuck yourself. Like, you don't know the first thing about me other than just YouTube videos. Um, you don't know anything about me, bro. And I think that's what, that's a reason why you want to make like these kinds of videos is because you want to try to like solidify all these corrupt thoughts about me because maybe just maybe it's bothering your consciousness. You know, maybe just maybe you realize that, oh wait, <laughs> I really fucked with a guy who didn't deserve it and you don't want to feel that kind of feeling and so you're making these videos hoping that you can find some kind of reassurance that what you're doing is good but in reality you're just a sick piece of shit <laughs> you need to get psychological help a lot of you are sociopaths and I, I mean it's just more than evident bro <laughs> like you really are to my gang stalkers you guys are just beyond fucked up. And I genuinely hope that you do get help in your life. But um, I gave way too much attention to my trolls by saying that. You know, for talking about this for like five minutes now. But um, I know it's going to be a chill holiday season. I'm not going to involve myself with silly stupid drama. I'm not going to go back on TikTok and become a, you know, a famous troll on there. Um, last year I was playing a lot of Silent Hill, <clears throat> I remember. I don't think I'll be doing a lot of video games this Halloween season. I kind of want to just tell ghost stories, and I hope you guys enjoy that. Um, I used to have a book, I gave it back, but it's called Scary Stories to Tell in the Dark. Uh, it's one of my favorite books in the world. Uh, there's actually three, it's like a three, um, series kind of thing. And, uh, you can read it for free, though, on Google, if you Google it. But, uh, yeah, I want to share those stories with you guys because I love those books, dude. And, uh, you know, <laughs> I don't exactly do much book stuff on here. So I guess that gives me an excuse to do something different. But anyways, guys, I hope you all enjoy your Halloween season. Um, you know what I'm saying? Get festive. Decorate your house. Uh, it's good to get in the spirit of things. It really is, man. Um, and just, you know... Watch your favorite Halloween shows. Distract yourself from this bullshit reality we're in right now. You know, because it's, it's really a sad world. It really is, man. You turn on the TV, you're, you're going to hear a bunch of really sad news. And I think the holidays are a, uh, are a great way to just sort of get away from all that. But anyways, guys, I <laughs> hope you enjoyed my sexy... Let me give you a stand-up here. Hopefully I'm, <laughs> I'm decent, but... Um... It's a stand up. <laughs> I had to rip it, bro, because of my gut to make it fit. <laughs> there you go. Um, I don't want to go any lower than that because, well, I don't want to gross you guys out too much. <laughs> and there are things poking out that probably shouldn't be poking out. So <laughs> we'll just leave it there, guys. But uh, until next time, y'all. Have a great Halloween season. And I also wanted to say really quick, um, <clears throat> rest in peace to the great Peter Robbins. That's right. The original voice of Charlie Brown. And sadly and ironically, he took his life a few years ago. Uh, which, I mean, maybe he would want us to laugh at the irony of that, being that he played a cartoon character that was always depressed. But nonetheless, it was a very sad thing to hear. And um, <clears throat> I just wanted to say too, guys, you know, the holidays can be very hard for people who suffer with depression. So if you know somebody who's going through some shit, don't hesitate to reach out to them. You could save somebody's life. So thanks, guys, for watching. We'll see you on the next, uh, we'll see you on the next one. And stay tuned for more ghost stories. 
real, real soon. Peace.